Bhuvan and Dew in reality are two geographic locations, both of which are enclosed by Gujarat. Daman near Surat is in the south of Gujarat, while Dew is an island near Junagar in the Saurashtra Peninsula of Gujarat. An easy and enjoyable way to reach Daman is via the Western Railways. All major express mail and local trains take a break at Bapi, a very important stoppage in the railway route between Mumbai and Delhi. Vapi is also close to Daman, only about 12 kilometers away. Once in Vapi, it is just a matter of hopping into a taxi and the service charge is on a per head basis. Missed Vapi? Well, the Valsad Junction is just another 23 kilometers. Travel by road means driving along the broad and fast-tracked Mumbai Ahmedabad National Highway No. 8 all the way to Daman via Vapi. Road-wise, some prominent locations and their distances are Mumbai, 193 km, Ahmedabad, 367 km, Diu, 763 km, Panaji via Mumbai, 787 km. An airport of international standing, the Chhatrapati Shivaji Airport, Mumbai, is the closest air link to Daman and Diu. The airport caters to both domestic and international flights. After a short ride from Bapi station, we've reached the gates of Daman. Can't wait to see what's inside. Come join me in this journey. Historically, Daman and Diu along with Goa were under the Portuguese for over 450 years. They became a part of the Republic of India on December 19, 1961 now celebrated as Liberation Day. Daman and Diu, till 1987, were administered as a part of Goa. In 1987, Goa became a state and Daman and Diu Union territories. Portuguese impact still survives in these areas, visible in some places through old churches and houses and in others through a small population who still speak Portuguese. A major part of the community, however, speaks Gujarati. <laughs> 